guys, it's Ashley from Not A True Reviews and today we are unboxing Spice Breeze. Um, this is a monthly culinary subscription. Um, basically when you sign up, you will get to select from their menu. You can choose either two spice kits or three spice kits. Um, you can also select the size of those depending on your family size. Um, and spice kits, I should tell you guys what those are. So a spice kit is a recipe and all the spices you need to create the recipe. So you'll still need to get the ingredients, but um, the spices are all included. They are organic, non-GMO, all that good stuff. This is the three recipe kit. Um, subscriptions start at $6.90 a month. It is my favorite cooking subscription. I just love all the different places it takes you. So every month they feature a different location, like an exotic locale, and then they'll get your recipe from that location and the other recipes are kind of what you pick and stuff like that. So I think it's really neat. I've been doing this one for years. Um, and then I do create one of these recipes each month on my blog. I'll link to that below. I'll also link to Spice Breeze. You know the drill. If you've been here before, you know how this goes. You know this. All right, anyway, let's open this baby up. Ooh, I smell cumin. All right. All right. This is... There's like a fact on the back here. Anyway, culinary spice box, spice free. So you open it up inside, you have 2022, super cute, right? Um, and you have all your recipes and then you open it and then there's all your spices. It's beautiful. It always looks like really pretty and it smells like a spice shop. It's just very like intoxicating. I, I love it. Like, Anyway, all right, so we have 2022. Happy New Year, Year of the Tiger. Lunar New Year, also called Spring Festival, is one of the biggest celebrations in the world. February 1st, 2022 is the beginning of the Year of the Tiger. For every Chinese zodiac animal, there are specific aspects that are considered lucky. For tigers, blue, green, blue and green are lucky colors, while 1, 3, and 7 are considered their lucky numbers. Those born in the Year of the Tiger are said to be brave and active people who are interested in living an adventurous life. Native tigers are Jim Carrey, Megan Fox, Leonardo DiCaprio, Dr. Phil, and Sean Mendes. On New Year's Eve, the dinner table is filled with traditional lucky foods, long noodles, symbolizing longevity, spring rolls, dumplings, fish, and rice cakes, wealth and prosperity, sweet rice balls, family togetherness, and completeness. So there's that. All right. So which one am I going to make? I don't know. Let's look at these. So first up, we have Loba Pong, a Taiwanese culinary spice kit. A Loba Pong, or in Chinese, Lu Rufan, translates to braised minced pork or rice. The signature Taiwanese comfort food is traditionally made with minced pork belly. In other parts of the country, ground meat is preferred. The key to the deep flavor experience is cooking the meat in two steps. First, fry the meat in oil and then slow cook it in a savory sauce. The dish is supposed to be a bit on the salty side. So this is Loba Pong. Um, the packet for that is right here. And in that one packet, we have uh, fennel, star anise, cinnamon cloves, black pepper, Sichuan pepper, um, which is the one that makes your tongue kind of numb, if you've ever had it. I have. All right, next up, we have uh, rendang. I've actually made this before. This is an Indonesian dish. Uh, it's one of the most delicious meals of the world as voted by CNN readers and everybody who tasted it. It's typically made with beef cooked in coconut milk for many hours until the meat is tender and has absorbed the flavors of the exotic spices. Substitute beef with chicken for a faster version. Um, so in a packet we have right here, so one spice packet for this one. And there we have lemongrass, galangal, coriander, makrut, lime, lime, lime leaves, turmeric, and mild chili. All right, our third recipe is uh, kadhi pakora, which is a Pakistani dish. Um, that's uh, This recipe combines two, dish, two dishes, crisp pakora fritters and gravy style kadhi. Both use garbanzo or chickpea flour as the main ingredient, though variations are included. We recommend staying original. Garbanzo bean flour has a wonderful, unique taste. Think of falafel or hummus. Uh, you can order the flour online or grind dry beans. Tip, fry whole dried chilies in oil. Pour oil over the served kadhi. Mm. So there are two spice packets for this. There is this one here and then this one here, these two. In the first one, there's coriander, mild chili, fenugreek, turmeric, cumin, and asafoetida. 
And then in the second one, we have Ajwan and uh, cumin seeds. Now we also have in here a bonus, um, a bonus. They usually have like a spice packet that's like a table seasoning or something. This is Yerba Mate Green Leaves. Start the new year with the euphoria of chocolate and the strength of coffee combined with a healthful tea. Add eight to 12 ounces of boiling water per tea bag. Steep three to four minutes. There you go. Um, so that's everything that came in my Lunar New Year Spice Breeze package. If you want to check out that recipe, I will uh, link down below. And I'll also link to Spice Breeze with my affiliate link if you want to check them out. As always, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I'll see you next time.